Hello everyone, my name is Robert Height, and I'm currently a second year medical student at the University of Chicago Pritzker School of Medicine, and today I'll be giving a talk on a qualitative study on how the electronic health record is perceived by radiation oncology. So um, the electronic health record essentially serves as a tool and a central database that has lots of information about a patient that allows for this facilitation of care for this patient among different um, medical providers. And the perceptions of the EHR among physicians in terms of how they feel towards EHR as well as the physician-patient relationship has been examined across many different specialties, but um, a recent literature search has shown that this really hasn't been done in the field of radiation oncology. And so the aims of this study were basically to determine um, how radiation oncologists perceived the use of the EHR in their clinic, as well as perform a needs assessment in order to help propose solutions that would address any of the concerns that the radiation oncologist proposed. So from June to July of 2019, radiation oncologists were recruited through convenience sampling. They were interviewed by phone using um, a standardized transcript. These interviews were semi-structured. The interviews were recorded as well as transcribed and a qualitative analysis was performed using a grounded theory approach. Um, and the reason why we chose this was essentially because it would allow us to empirically study um, the qualitative data um, based on the information from the interviews and really examine the social concepts and relationships grounded in those interviews. So for the results, um, 15 radiation oncologists were interviewed and six themes were elicited from these interviews, which included the physician experience as a whole, um, fatigue and burnout, non-clinical components such as administrative work, um, work-life balance, and charting, which includes the time in which notes are charted into the HR, um, paper charts, etc. Additionally, the demographic information as well as the themes, sub-themes, and example quotations are included at the end of the presentation. So please feel free at any point to pause the presentation in order to have a more in-depth um, review of this information. So um, the quality of analysis of these interviews seem to indicate that radiation oncologists do have some negative feelings towards the EHR, and these um, feelings are or include a sense of stress, fatigue, burnout, and frustration. Um, the main thing that I want to highlight from this is that all of these different um, negative feelings um, that was um, you know, seen throughout most of these interviews was the fact that the EHR was used as a billing platform um, and wasn't really used to further enhance patient care and that the interface was not intuitive for radiation oncologists. And so potential solutions include more of a centralized EHR for radiation oncologists um, in order to help reduce excessive documentation, as well as a more user-friendly EHR in general. Limitations were the fact that most of the participants were in the Midwestern United States, there was a small sample size, and most radiation oncologists participated for five years or less. Um, here are the references. Thank you so much. I'll now take questions and I'll show you the uh, tables.